hello if um vitality is something you're looking for if your uh, well-being needs some improvement if you're looking for optimism today's episode is for you we are talking about carnelian let me show you carnelian carnelian is just so beautiful it's filled with a deep orange color and i just want to talk about it today um my name is Marie de Tullio. I'm the founder of uh, Crystal Energy, where we help people feel better in their body by using tools such as energy, such as crystals. And today I really want to talk about carnelian because I think it's a stone that is so... Well, it hasn't been given the value. It, 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 it does so much amazing work, especially if you're a woman. So carnelian is definitely for you. Um, let me explain to you uh, carnelian, what it is. It, it's, it's a variety of chalcedony. Um, and chalcedony, when you look at it, it is kind of made like um, jello. So if you see kind of a jello-ish color, often it's going to be a type of chalcedony. So carnelian is a type of chalcedony. You've seen the dark one I just showed, but there's also, you can see it in the much yellowish uh, color. It works amazing in both colors. You can see it really, really dark, uh, like this one. That works well. I'm like, can I see through it? No, I can't see through it. Um, carnelian is just absolutely amazing. Um, you can find it if you're look if you're going to the store chances are you'll find one like this um if you're lucky you might find a darker one like this even better the darker the better um often it can be even confused with sard with or if you have probably often heard about sardonyx which is sard mixed mixed with onyx like you could see in this one black and white the sard is the dark part and the onyx is the white well here is just sard it looks so much like carnelian the difference is if you cannot see through it's really a sard when you see through a bit that means the jello-ish part of it the jello part then you know it's a carnelian carnelian is often now in the market you're gonna find it often dyed um it's better than nothing so still work with it if it's dyed often the person will, selling it to you won't know so it doesn't matter at least it's better to work with a deeper richer color than not to work with the stone at all um carnelian is a water element stone so um often it it, it would feel good to um refresh your body it, when i say water element you, you can see you know the qualities of water that's going through anything carnelian will make its way through anything and that's the good that's the sorry that's the important part about carnelian it, it, it really um it's gonna get through the bottom of things um really 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 good stone for um anyone who has uh, period cramps uh ovary issues any fertility issues all of the second chakra issues we could say usually carnelian is really really good as i said the darkest color this one looks black or deep brown it doesn't look like it's orange but that's the deepest that's what you're looking for um if all you have is something that's really see-through like this that's okay use that use what you have you will feel the difference um carnelian is also very good for um if you're starting fever or um a cold that would be anything a sensitivity to temperature that would all go into carnelian field that would really help you um they could be put on the lungs if needed they could first choice is always on the second chakra it could even go on the stomach especially if there's a more yellowish color a lighter tint it, it's going to work really well on the stomach um carnelian is a good stone for anyone who is um you know someone who's always uh, with their dog they're like petting their dog all the time they just won't leave their dog alone or actually maybe the, the dog is seeking the love as well 
but that connection is not a normal connection. Uh, when you're seeking affection from your dog, carnelian is a good choice to learn to take your, keep your distance, you be you, the dog be him, and you can have time together, but not all the time. It's not about him giving you love or you giving him love. It's about just a partnership. Both are there and both are helping each other. So anytime you're feeling depressed, if you're feeling sluggish, like a lack of energy, carnelian is a good choice. Sometimes it's normal to feel um, depressed if you just had a huge loss if you're grieving something depression is absolutely normal then in that case carnelian is really good for you it's going to give you the optimism it's going to give you a vitality that you're looking for the something to boost you off so carnelian is always good it's like connecting you to the fountain of optimism of vitality of um even uh, it's going to give you the, the strength to face the challenge Carnelian will help enhance mental clarity and it, it will help you find positive emotions. So if you're depressed, that's something you're definitely looking for. So it, it's about bringing you a bright, brighter outlook and maybe even appreciation for the life lessons that are ahead of you. Anytime you're feeling a lack of in, inspiration, um, lack of enthusiasm for life, Carnelian is a good choice. I always talk about my best friend, tape. So I tape the stone. Usually I would say one hand under my belly button. That's what, where I would tape the stone. And usually I use solid tape because you want to make sure it doesn't fall, especially because it's going to be stuck in your pants. So you want it to be solid there, but that really works. You can leave it all there all day. Carnelian, I wouldn't necessarily use so much uh, during the night. Um, maybe sometime in the evening, but not overnight. But if you're comfortable with it, that's fine. In everything that I tell you, I really want you to test. Does that ring true for you? That's all that matters because we are all made of energy. Stones are made of energy. It, our, both our level of energy are kind of trying to match or even out. And sometimes yours is, might be a better match for Carnelian than mine. So test it, test it, test it, test it. So what would carnelian do for you? Well, it's, it's going to bring you as self-confidence for sure. It's going to bring, it's going to relax yourself on the mental level. Isn't that wonderful? It will balance your emotions. It will even, even out your cells and even balance your cells and brings you then better focus, better concentration when everything is like in its place when everything is balanced so much easier to just be right so carnelian is a good stone if you want to meditate and negative thoughts keep passing by carnelian go for carnelian and ha you know here i'm showing you a big stone here i'm showing you a small stone don't underestimate the power of a small stone on a Sometimes I will show you the bigger stones because first of all, it's easier for you to see, but know that when I treat people, chances are I put small stones 95% of the time. Small stones and even much smaller than that are very, very, very powerful. All we need is for um, our body to adjust to the energy of the stone, right? So we don't need the big stone for that to happen. And if you are overly stressed, the adrenals are working like crazy. So carnelian is a good choice. You could put carnelians on both your adrenals. That would make you feel good. If you have any kind of issue with menopause, arteritis, any joint pain issue, carnelian is a good choice. Carnelian is also an option when someone is kind of stubborn. Let's say that person is strong. Like I used to be a police officer. I was strong and I didn't need gut. I could just go ahead and do things, right? But it was harder for me to accept change. I was really stubborn. I didn't, I, it was my way or the highway. Carnelian, really good for people like that. So anytime, any people that's 
a lawyer, a police officer, a, a doctor, anyone who's used to being in charge will definitely benefit from carnelian to getting that softer side. So it brings you back to that balance that we're, we're absolutely needed needing, especially if we were in that field. And sometimes, you know, uh, we could be, I could see officers or I'm saying police officers, but it, it could be for so many professions, but people are just, they could be so rude to their spouse. And from the outside, someone looking at them would say, why were you that rude? And we don't take that so well, <laughs> usually being told how to act, but carnelian will make us think and maybe change our behavior over time. So carnelian is really good for us. And it's not about making us soft, not at all. It's just being open to change and being open to something better. So, um, it's also good for people that are sometimes on the other extreme. I'll give you an example. I had a friend who had two sons and somehow one of them could just get away with just about murder while the other one was being so directed. Everything he was doing was like not good and the other one could just do anything and they would never get mad at him. Well, in that case, Carnelian is a good choice. Again, he's gonna, it, it gives us a different perspective so we can change our behavior. Um, so Carnelian is really about all kinds of things it, from your woman's part, if you have any kind of period issues, if you have any kind, type of um, ovary or painful or anything that relates to that, it's gonna be really helpful. Any type of depression, if you feel depressed and all that, carnelian is really good. What I would do for carnelian in that case, I would put it here. When I say on the third eye, remember it's never here, it's always here. So you could put one like this, could be like this. It doesn't matter, but just please, when you're, especially if you're working here, put a small one. You don't need a big one. And um, so what will you get from carnelian you'll get a greater optimism for sure vitality you're going to get joy from living uh, it will increase your mental clarity once you see better through your thoughts and all that life is so much easier it will better align your aspiration with where with your path where you're going where you want to go where you're going it, it's going to kind of merge together as you're uh, cleaning everything that's in the way it's really relaxing it will give you a, a breath of life so if you have more energy you can do more in your day well that's priceless I really suggest I don't know if you've tried carnelian before but please please do so spend a day if, if you don't have tape to put it on you obviously if you're putting here you're putting it in the morning when you get up or you can do that at night you can do just five ten minutes that will definitely help you if you're feeling sluggish or depressed but uh, during the day you can have it in your pockets that's always good um carnelian is really really good stone to have with you it will even help any kind of uh, hormonal um, imbalance so try it there's no such thing as there's nothing better than trying it so carnelian amazing stone uh, let me show you this is a fire agate but or snake agate or they kind of look so similar to carnelian and to me they kind of have basically the same value so you could use one or the other it's going to be absolutely amazing for your body it's really energetic food for your body so please if you like today's episode, I want you to share it with people. Let, let them know that you en enjoyed what we talked about. If you're thinking of someone that could use any of that information, please share it. And I want you to write down what, what is your favorite stone? I want to know what is your favorite stone so that in the following weeks, maybe I can talk about your favorite stone. So, and you tell me not only what is your favorite stone, but why is it your favorite stone? So on that note, I want to say thank you for being here. Remember, I always end on the same note, but you only have one body, right? No replacement parts. So please take good care of it. And to me, taking good care of it starts with um, good food, lots, lots, lots of water, uh, exercise and crystals.
or any type of energy work that will make sure you take care of your body and meditation. So what are you going to put in place this week that you maybe didn't do for the last week or for the last month or for the last 10 years that you really want to put back in place that you know will help your energy level? Because stones can only go so far. You need to do your part. On that note, have a wonderful week and I'll see you next week.